Hi, Simon here. This is a very brief video on how to record your mixers in Tractor Pro or Tractor Scratch Pro and then convert your mixers to MP3 so you can burn them onto CD. First things first, and that's to show you what we're running things through. There's Tractor, the program, Tractor Pro. It's running on a MacBook Pro aluminium going straight to the Omni Newmark Omni controller which also acts as the sound card and um, from the Omni controller straight out the back to two speakers so we're not using the mixer the DJM 800 there CDJs aren't hooked up simply the um, MacBook Omni controller and then two speakers just so you know what version of Tractor Pro it is, I don't know if you can see that whether it will focus in, but it's version 112004 and then just to confirm there it's got 2D internal mixer on Tractor. First thing we need to do is just have a look at the settings. So we go to the, the uh, top left, click Tractor there, it brings in, down the drop down box into Preferences and then we need to go to output routing just to check we're on internal mixer and then you've got output master one and two and they're going straight to the omni controller we then go down to recording there highlights it up again just to double check there it's internal and the directory where the mix is going to get saved um, is listed there that's the default so I don't see any reason to change it uh, it's simply going to the Macintosh hard drive users my name my music file then the subfolder tractor and then recordings but we'll come on to that later and I'll show you it and it's very simple prefix call your mix what you want so I'm going to call this one maxi boy dis goes okay maxi boy disc goes and that split file at whatever size now it's got 64 meg 650 700 2048 i don't really want to split my mix so i'm just going for the top um, number there then we can close that down at the bottom the next thing we do is bring up the record box now it's not there on the default um, layout it's hiding so you go to the top right and just there where the mouse is is where the effects are FX2 it says in the top right there just below that is a little icon of a cassette click the icon and then it goes to the record part there it's got broadcast we're not interested in that there's the record button there's the gain and there's our levels okay so we're going to set our levels first I've got two tracks in so I'll just set the first one playing And then we can see our levels going up and down quite nicely. If they go into the red, then there's a little gain button and you just move that with your mouse, turn it down. So that's uh, quite nice, I'm quite happy with that level. So now we need to record a mix. So I have two tracks lined up in deck A and in deck B. In deck A we've got Heartbreak, the club mix, the Freemasons featuring Sophie Ellis Baxter. And in deck two, we've got Our House is Dadless, the Bimbo Jones edit uh, by Kid British, um, which is released in a couple of weeks' time, I believe. Uh, July the 6th, it's available for download. So a bit of a, an exclusive preview here for you. It is going to be massive, by the way. Right, ignoring that, we're going to mix these two together. It's not about the mix, because I'm going to be doing it one-handed with no headphones. It's about showing you how to record and then uh, get it to MP3. So, let's go. But what we mustn't forget to do is press the record button. So up there, I'm going to click the record button. Now recording. Let's play the decks. Okay, so there you have your mix. I'm just taking it down and now I'm going to press stop and it's stop recording. 
So what we have to do now is retrieve our mix. We do this by getting rid of tractor. Then as I said, this is the Mac operating system. So the default file, if you remember from earlier, it was in Macintosh HD. So we double click that. It was in Users Simon. So I could go Users or just click Simon there. It was in Music, Tractor, and then it brings up Recordings. Double click this, and there's our recording, and it says WAV, and there's the title we gave it, which was Maxi Boy Discos, and then there's the date, the size of what we've recorded, I think it is, dot WAV. Now, right, we can't burn that to anything, we need it to MP3. And you just simply double click this, and it automatically puts it, and as you've seen, opens up iTunes. And it's playing it automatically for me now. So we'll stop that, and you can see there it is in iTunes below that. Four tracks I've down dance tracks I've downloaded yesterday from uh, Michael Jackson. And then DJ only 125, which I've yet to do a preview of. Okay, so we now need this to be MP3. So it's highlighted, or you would click on it, then you would right click to bring down the drop down box. One, two, three, four down. It says create MP3 version. So I guess I'm going to click that. And that little sound tells me that it's created an MP3 version above it. I'll just check that. I'll highlight it, I'll double click, I'll get info. Under summary, format MPEG 1 layer 3, MP3 version of my mix. So I can now go to info, I don't want to call it that anymore, I'm going to not call it Maxi Boy Discos, I'm going to call it Simon's Mix. No, 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 I'm on YouTube, I'm called Pridders Mix. I'm called Pridders on YouTube, so there you go. Okay, so now we've got Pridders Mix there. There's the original WAV one I've highlighted. I'm going to delete that. You don't have to if you don't want to. But I'm going to move it to my trash. And I'm just going to go with my mix. I can then obviously add my own art, etc. But more importantly, if you want to put your mixes to CD, you just put this into a playlist and then burn your playlist to CD. There you have it then, a very brief video on how to record in Tractor Pro or Tractor Scratch Pro. I presume the record in Tractor Scratch Pro is, is identical. Um, I hope you enjoyed that, I hope you might have learned something from that. Um, any questions or comments then please by all means uh, leave them below there. I'm not professing in any way shape or form to be an expert on Tractor Pro, I'm learning all the time. Um, there you go, practice and enjoy. Catch you later.